Hey! Welcome home! <laughs> What's up everybody? We are inside of our room at the uh, Valencia Hotel. Um, this Valencia Hotel is pretty much a Spanish, colonial, modern day feel. Uh, it's very nice. We're going to go through the room tour real quickly and then I'll show you a little bit of the features of this hotel. Um, I think by chance price and amenities and features of this hotel is one of the best prices here in San Antonio when you stay. So let's get into this full tour. So the room that we have is a King Courtyard room. Um, the King Courtyard room is of course again a uh, king size room, you have your, your king bed and the patio has a bistro sitting area for two and the doors lead right out and you can view the um, actual courtyard area and the courtyard area houses little live entertainment which we're going to have tonight which is going to be really cool um, so literally it looks like floors three, um, four, and five are your balcony areas and like I said, uh, they have a little bistro area out there for sitting down and pretty much having a nightcap or <laughs> morning coffee, things of that nature. So the room is set up really well. They do have other rooms where um, there is a riverside view with the bistro as well. So you get to see the river and the people. But I just think that side would be a little too noisy, especially if you are, have been out there all day and you want to come back and just have a little bit of peace and quiet. This side is great. And then not to mention, it looks fantastic in the courtyard did a really good job with that so um, other than that they do have some executive suites and things of that nature um, but this room <clears throat> really great for the value a little sitting area an extra couch um, and the bathroom is amazing uh, I think right now you know when we talk about safety uh, this is one of the hotels that I checked out to see all their safety measures and cleaning measures that they take during this COVID-19 time. Uh, so I felt comfortable about booking a room here. Um, and then all the amenities and things that they have, of course, are disposable and brand new. So um, I think this is my new favorite spot here. Uh, we came here before and I stayed at a Hyatt that was really nice uh, for my wife's birthday. But this place is awesome. Um, all you can think about for everything that you want. You have your coffee maker, um, they have bottles of water, they have a mini fridge inside of this suite. Now I don't know if they have that in the other rooms, um, but there's a mini fridge with different things and um, your bottle of water, uh, you have your standard clock and one huge mirror. The mirror is great. I, I think I've seen this mirror. Too. Who? The chargers. Yeah, so my wife just reminded me. They do have chargers. So if you left yours at home, they have lightning, they have USB, USB-C. They have them all here um, tucked away just in case you miss out on them. Um, I'm trying to think. That's oh, let me show you guys. Here are the chargers. They're in the container. So they have the whole get up for you. I'm quite sure there's a charge for it, guys, but... Yeah. It's for smartphones, but it's a whole charging kit. Then they also have... I don't know what that is. I don't know. I thought it was... It's fancy? dried fruit. Oh, it's dried fruit. How cool is that? So They're all, everything is all packaged like this, um, which is great. Do some social distancing things, so they don't want you to touch nothing. I think she meant COVID-19, but we'll let her have that. Oh, yeah. You guys know <laughs> what I <that> meant. <laughs> So yeah, this is the room. Like I said, it's a good size. Um, I wish I could have showed you the regular uh, king room without the balcony. I mean, I'm pretty sure those are pretty much the same here, but who wouldn't want a patio and a sitting area to sit out at night or even first thing in the morning? So this is the room I decided to get. And uh, if you come to San Antonio, Valencia Hotel is definitely a, a good value stay for its money. And there you have it. This is how we embrace the romance of downtown San Antonio by staying at what is known as the number one best hotel in San Antonio. And this is all by reader's choice. Now, I will say from a safety standpoint, they had it down packed. I mean, they gave you a letter as soon as you walked in showing you the thorough cleaning process that they have for each room. And the safe thing that they take among their guests as far as why social distancing, distancing is concerned, 
uh, your your food items and everything like that. So this is a lovely, lovely hotel. Um, I can't say enough about it. Um, it is more of an adult hotel. Well, it's themed more for adults, but there was kids there. It's not much for kids to do, but it's a beautiful hotel. Uh, wonderful food items, lovely bar, a lovely service, even during this time. I mean, you can tell that they were short staffed due to COVID, um, but it was lovely. The package that we received came with a night of dancing, which you probably saw in the last vlog. Um, but it had a wine and cheese plate and it was just a beautiful night within the courtyard uh, People on the first floor could just open their doors and pretty much see anything and then from where we stayed on the balcony You could actually open your door and see it but having a de designated table with our names and things on it to enjoy The lovely dancing and tango that they had going on was great Couldn't ask for more within this hotel. You couldn't ask for more where it was on the river walk it was a great opportunity, great price, um, friendly staff again, and I believe technically I could stay here every time I go to San Antonio. I think uh, next time I'll get a room on the other side by the river, but you couldn't beat it. All right, let's dive back into it. See, this hotel is really decorative. Again, I just like the architecture behind things. I think that was one of the reasons why I picked this hotel in the first place. But it's now one of my favorites here in San Antonio. I don't know, when, I, when we visit different countries and different places, I, I like to stay in the, the older architect, but still modern places. And this is definitely one of them. They had a beautiful restaurant that's attached to them and like you just saw this is right on the river right on river walk and their restaurant durego um, that they have here full service restaurant opens at five o'clock it takes reservations only um, you can actually go downstairs and the rest of the restaurant is down there right on the water so if you want to eat by the water you could and then the rest of the rooms that are attached with the courtyard balconies are facing the river Again, there's a lot of, you know, people moving and things and stuff at night, so it was just better being in the courtyard. However, this is an amazing hotel. Uh, everything is laid out just right. It's beautiful when you walk in. It's beautiful throughout the entire hotel. Everything is, is, is very handcrafted and designed, which really is good. And it's been here for a while. So, um, again, it, it's not busy, but I will say it was, um, it was more people here than I expected. So, again, you know, staying safe. People, you know, are getting stir crazy. They want to get out, and you can tell it. You know, it may not be as busy as pre-COVID days, but people are out. And um, you know, I keep looking up here because there's a there's a bird that keeps flying by. But <laughs> don't mind me on that. Uh, it's it's nice out here, and the weather's beautiful. Everything is covered, so even when you are outside, you don't you're not burning up while you're there. So anyway. Breakfast is coming. Uh, they serve all your breakfast to the room or you can have it out here. So I got it coming upstairs. So let's head back upstairs. I'll show you some of the hallways and the elevator. And, and that's pretty much it at the Valencia Hotel. You know, you get a chance, come out here. So one of the biggest things that I will say that may come to a shock for a lot of people in this hotel 
is they do not have a pool. So if you're expecting to lounge around and have the kids go back and forth, they don't have it. This is more of your adult size hotel, courtyard, little tango dancing, dinner, cocktails, you name it. Now this is what I enjoy with this room. Let me show y'all. Now that I'm out here, this is what I like. You pay for this view. It's quiet and it's a little courtyard. You got the waterfall you can look at. You can look up, you see birds and stuff coming through. But it's beautiful. Babes are there getting dressed. And I'm gonna sit out here drink this coffee and wait on breakfast. Hope y'all enjoyed this uh, tour of the hotel, our room. We got many more to come. Uh, I really do research behind where we stay and I have little meanings on what I like and what I know she'll like. And this one right here was for me. Uh, it's not a hidden gem in Austin. But it is a place to stop if you come to Texas. This is in San Antonio. Good morning. Okay, this is what I woke up to this morning. Breakfast. Looks very good. Um, you have a salsa. I mean, it's awesome. I don't know what they call this plate. That's just the egg skillet. So you have your bacon, your tomato, fresh, fresh onion, tomato, cilantro. I mean, everything in a <laughs> breakfast you will want is in this plate. So this is what I woke up to this morning. Last night was a I love you with all my heart card. I'm not going to read it because it's not your business. But <laughs> this morning I woke up to what do I mean when I say I love you? Mm, I don't know. <coughs> Last night I shook this card, right guys? And I was like this before I read it. Ain't no money in there. How much do you love me? <laughs> so this morning he woke up and he decided to go downstairs and put $100 in the card. I'm like, mm-hmm. What do you want next? <laughs> and that was in this card. $100 worth of love. <laughs> you know what that means, right? Mm-mm. Sound like a setup. <laughs> but anyway, guys, I'm going to go ahead and dive into this. So far, and my husband took my fork, but that's okay. I'll take his. Oh. That's okay. Let me let you guys know how this tastes, okay? Um, so you have the tomato. I'm quite sure I don't know if you can see it or not. But here's the spinach, tomato, uh, egg, salsa. This, this really looks good. And that was it. So we'll see y'all later. Mm. We'll it's eat. good though. Peace. Mm. And there you have it, steeped in history and charm, Hotel Valencia Riverwalk is an exceptional hotel. Thank you all for watching, and until then, see you soon.